Hello, all my name is Adonis, and welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to be doing a love or loss spread for all of my fellow burrows out there. So, let's get after it. Okay. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Show me cards I need to see. Show me cards I need to see. What types of energies are my fellow Virgos currently dealing with? What kind of energies are my fellow Virgos currently dealing with? All well, you guys wanted to know what my sign was. I am a Virgo. All right, so here we go. That feels great. Child. Okay, so here we go. Deal with someone right now, nine of wands. This person is being very apprehensive, a little bit on the cautious side. I might want to say, They're feeling very cautious and uh, a little bit cautious and, and defensive also. All right. Um, there's also a, a feeling here with the um, with this whole eight of swords thing. This person's kind of feeling like their hands are tied behind their back too. So they're kind of cautious and apprehensive because they feel like they're, they're, their hands are tied behind their back. So they, they feel like they're limited in their movement. Like there's something that they want to do, they want to say, but there are limitations to them being able to do the things that they want to do and want to say, okay? Pertaining pertaining to, 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 to you, all right? Now, even with that being the case, even with that sense of being limited, being able to limitations of what they can do, you know, we got the cherry card. This person's still saying, you know what? I'm still going to um I'm going to, I'm going to implement this this leadership aspect here. I'm going to still I'm going to jump in this thing and try to move it towards where I want it to go to. So they're going to kind of try to shift the conversation and try to get it to where they needed to get to it. Kind of get you on the same page as them even though they kind of feel like there's there's things preventing them to do it. They're going to do it anyway. They're going to they're going to see what they can do anyway to make it happen. Uh, things there's definitely a fork in the road here with this individual too. All right, so you know they're like, okay, you know what? It's here, it's there. I'm gonna go this way. All right. Um, now with them moving towards this action, taking this action. All right. There is a burden that's being removed from them because they're finally acting on what they've wanted to act on for quite some time here. So you know this person, right? This is an X. This is an X. All right. So again, this person, this is, you know, just recap real, real quick because I'm not done with the reading, but just to recap here. So they were a little cautious, you know, like, you know, should I, shouldn't I? I don't know. All right. They were feeling trapped. And, 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 and limited in their movement because you guys are no longer together, all right? But they're like, you know what? I'm going to go for it. I'm, I'm, I'm going to go for it. I'm going to see what happens. So, again, they, they, they put, they, they're trying to move the, move the goalposts and kind of bring you to their way of thinking or at least get you to notice them, all right? They realize with the Two of Swords that there is a fork in the road here, all right? That they are, they are at a, you know... You know, there are the place here where the things are kind of like stagnated at the moment. But them acting on this, kind of getting this getting this thing off their chest, putting it out there in the universe, saying, you know what? Let the universe take this baby and see where it takes us. So that's that's the Ten of Wands, you know, the removal of a burden. This judgment card is the X that's here. Alright? Because they got the Ten of Cups here. They want to be happy. They want to be happy, and they think that getting back with you will make them happy. So they want another shot. They they want another opportunity to try to kind of convince you to bring them over to their side, to their way of thinking. They pretty much just want an audience to be able to explain. I'm, I'm really feeling like they just really want an audience and an opportunity to really explain their perspective, their point of view. Because at the moment, things are just stagnant. Hangman energy here. There ain't nothing going nowhere. Everything is just complete completely stop come to a complete halt all right so that's what's going on <clears throat> as far as the energy so let's see what what particular strengths what, what is the particular strength of this particular situation what's the particular strength of you guys coming back together as a union let's see what are the strengths of this particular situation what are the strengths of this particular situation what are the strengths of this particular situation 
what are the strengths of this particular situation? Okay. All right, here we go. Excellent. So, what are the strengths of this particular situation? All right, so, strengths are their sneaky behavior has been brought to the surface. All right, it's been discussed, it's been talked about. That's more than likely why the relationship kind of was dissolved to begin with because there was some sneaky behavior that was engaged here. Um, so, that's what happened with that. Now, um, and it's been talked about. It's out there front. So that's a strength because it's already that's it's already out there in the ether. You know about it. They know about it. They discussed it. Probably broke up because of it. There's that. We got the death card here though. Got the death card here though. So death card meaning out with the old, in with the new, um, new energy endings, new beginnings. Okay. So there's, you know, once you know, once this conversation is the potential here. There's the potential. Okay, not saying it is, but there's the potential here for there to be a new beginning. Why? Because we got the Five of Cups here. Regretful. There's a sense of regret. Looking back at the situation, realizing that they were wrong about what they did, how they went about doing it. So there is this, this, this taking of ownership of, of, of what happened. Okay, not, not trying to... Chuck and job responsibility, taking responsibility for the things that they've done. All right. The, the fact that they are a little apprehensive, you know, that there, you know, there's not, a, there's not a sense of arrogance here. Like, I, you know, it's a sense of remorsefulness, of a sense of being a little timid, if you will. Like, I didn't know if, 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 if my, I didn't know if I was going to be received, but I'm, you know, you're coming with a sense of humility. In other words, the person's coming with a sense of humility, being kind of humble. Also, just, you know, being somewhat vulnerable, be a little, a little cautious. And that's you're going to be able to see that. Also, justice card, truth, a revelation of truth, a revelation of truth. So there's going to be some honest to goodness, true discussions about, okay, what happened? Why did it happen? How, how did it happen before? You know? That, that type of thing, like a lot of this is coming to the surface. It's going to, the conversation is really going to be had at this point. Now, the will of fortune is moving in in favor of there being somewhat of, 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 of a peaceful resolution to this. Maybe, maybe, maybe even more. Maybe even more because we got the eight of pentacles here. This person is obviously willing to, to, to roll up their sleeves and put in the work and put in the time. Put in the time and, and do the repetitive task that need to be done to repair the situation, okay? And also we got the two of wands here. So, you know, we're obviously, you know, there's a choice. There's a choice here to go to go this way to, to move forward. And, you know, the hope is that you'll be willing to forgive and move forward, okay? So, with that being the case... Um, let's now see. All right, what are the what are the current blockages to the situation to this union? Okay, what are the potential blockages to this union? What are the potential blockages to so them back together? All right, all right. There you go. Ooh. Ooh. All righty. All righty. Let me take a drink. Because the blockages are a plenty and serious. So, Ten of Swords. Betrayal. You were stabbed in the back. Ruination of plans. All right. Cause that tower moment. Kaboom. That tower moment there. Okay? These are all the potential blockages here. Things have been put on hold. Stagnation. There's been some stagnation 
because of what happened. So things are kind of things are kind of stale at the moment here. Okay. Um, you want to have your wishes fulfilled. You want to have your wishes fulfilled. Those wishes being what I'm feeling here. What I'm feeling and what I'm seeing here is that the wishes that you want to have fulfilled is loyalty. Honesty is great. Honesty is, honesty is a great start. But you want loyalty. Okay? And, you know, um, even if, even, I'm getting a sense here, even if you could forget. Give. You couldn't forget. You couldn't forget. It's, it's, it's getting past that initial betrayal. Okay. Um, hope renewal. Hope uh, uh, re rebirth renewal. Um, you know, again, like I said, having that fresh start. That that even though you know your ex is ready for, you know, for that fresh start. You're, you're, it doesn't appear like you're ready to move on. Um, that, that you're ready to move on to to give them a second chance, rather. Um, we got the Ace of Wands here. Um, the lack of sexual attraction. Because of what they've done. Mentally, okay, mentally, you've turned yourself off to being sexually attracted to this individual. Okay? It happens. And finally here we got the five of cups. Meaning, looking back in regret. Regretting what happened. Looking back in the past. Wishing it didn't happen. Again, it's the emotional aspect of cups. are all about emotion. And it's all about you're not able to get past that initial hurt. So that's, that is a heck of a thing to have to overcome. But with that being said here. Okay, so is there, this is a love or loss situation. I'm going to say it's probably going to be a loss. Um, at this mountain, at this point, not to say it's going to always be like this, but at this point, this mountain is just a little bit too hot to climb. All right? So, with that being said here, let's see what additional information the Spirit wants to give. Before I shut this thing down, what additional information the Spirit wants to give? Before I shut this thing down, what additional information the Spirit wants to give? Shut this thing down. What is this information? One more shuffle. One more shuffle. Here we go. Okay, so perception at the moment. Your perception of the situation is very negative. It's a very negative perception that you have, okay, of the situation, and that's why you're not going to be able to move, to move, to move past it. You just, you just, you just, you just can't. Not at the moment, all right. Um, in addition, you want someone that's going to be dependable. Dependability means a great deal. Being able to depend on this individual, giving your heart to this person, being able to depend on them, not to break it, not to squeeze it, not to crush it, all right. That's that that's that's the rub here. I'm trying to get over that, okay? They're not very dependable and very reliable um, in matters of matters of the heart. It, it possibly also is probably other aspects of things mixed in with that as well. So that's that. Finally, here's stretch, okay? Um, it's going to require you, and like I said, I do not feel like you can do this right now. Um, it's going to require you to really stretch yourself in, in, into all kinds of different interesting shapes and directions to kind of forgive this individual at this point in time. I mean, it's, it's going to take some, some, some you know, death-defying act of, 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 you know, stretching ability. And, and you, just, you just can't do it, you know, just emotionally... You know, you're still not there. You're still not in a good place. You're kind of, you know what I mean? So that, that you're still in a wreck place right now. And so that's not going to happen. All right. So with that being said, I'm going to shut this thing down now. Um, okay, guys, this is a general love reading. It may not resonate with everyone, but if it does resonate with you, all right, if you want to know more about this situation, the link will be below. 
if this did not resonate with you, that is fine also. Um, and you want to know more about your particular situation, the link will be below. All right. Um, if you guys haven't already, please like, please share, and absolutely subscribe. All right. My name is Adonis. I love you guys, and I will absolutely, positively see you next time.